What's up guys, this is II Host here and today I want to go ahead and go over a video of uh, the 4.3.1 or 4.3 Jailbreak Ultra Snow. Um, the problem that you guys, all the unlockers out there that are having problems with the Ultra Snow um, unlock program for the dev team. Now if you guys did the 4.3.1 or 4.3 Jailbreak and you tried to unlock your iPhone using T-Mobile with a SIM card, uh, by using Ultra Snow, you will notice that um, once you installed Ultra, Ultra Snow and rebooted your iDevice, it will say no service up there where your carrier should be, even though the uh, SIM card was inserted. Um, there has been a problem, so that means Ultra Snow was not working, and uh, you just had the no service thing until you uninstalled it, and uh, you were stuck on no service basically so now I have a fix for you guys for the ultra snow if you guys are an unlocker for T-Mobile um, I think that's the only carrier that you can actually can unlock too so anyway what you're gonna have to do is just open up your Cydia once you're jailbroken on any on the 4.3.1 or 4.3 firmware now I have the Verizon iPhone so this is not gonna help me whatsoever but this is for you guys uh, to fix the problem so once you have that, uh, you, you guys may know that you're going to need Ultra Snow from the repos will be down in the description down below. And this is Ultra Snow. That's the Ultra Snow, and um, you're going to need the you're going to need the correct baseband, of course, to be able to be able to use this. And the baseband's are right there. Uh, you guys can go ahead and pause the video and make sure that your baseband is correct. And by the time uh, this video is over. I'll show you how to find your baseband if you were unsure, and then you can go ahead and make sure one of these baseband is the correct one for you. So all the baseband's are 01.59.00, 04 05.11.06, 05.1201, 05.1304, and 06.15.00. There, all these baseband's will be down below in the description, and uh, that's basically it for the ultra snow. Um, so now the fix for the Ultra Snow is Ultra Snow Fixer for 4.3.1. So you're going to need to add a repo for this, of course. And all I did was search Ultra Snow, and Ultra Snow came up for the Insane Layer repo and the repo 666.ultrasnow.com, which I will give you in the description below if you don't have this, which you should already. But if you don't, I'll give it to you. So the repo that you're going to need to add is the repo.insanelyi.com, be in the description below. And you're just going to search Ultra Snow Fixer for 4.3.1. So once you're gonna go, one, first you want to install Ultra Snow, the regular Ultra Snow, and then you want to install the fixer for, it, and then reboot your iPhone, and you should be good to go, and no, no problem should happen, and you should be fine. Um, I had my friend had this problem, my friend from school, and I told him about this, and it worked perfectly fine on his iPhone 4 with AT&T, and now it is unlocked on T-Mobile for 4.3.1. So this is basically the fix for it, guys. That's that's all I have for you today. And also, I'll go ahead and show you how to find your uh, baseband. So just go into your settings application. Then you want to go ahead and click general, which should be right here. And then you want to click the about. And then you want to scroll down all the way down here until you see modem firmware, which is mine is 1.0.05. That is going to be your baseband, guys. So if you were wondering on your baseband, that should be it. And uh, if you have the correct baseband, good job for you guys. I uh, hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, so I will see you in the next one. Peace out, guys.